Hello my friends and welcome back to the channel and to Resident Evil Code Veronica X. Uh, what the heck? <sighs> so this was actually my first Resident Evil game. Back uh like in the early two thousands. I didn't even know Resident Evil was a thing. Didn't even know Resident Evil was a thing beyond this game. Heck, I didn't even pay attention to the name of the game itself. It was just another game uh, I tried playing several times. The only point I remember getting to was the <laughs> the graveyard in the beginning. I don't remember whether or not I got past that point, only to not progress any further but the only uh, vivid memories I have of this game was simply getting to the graveyard and dying repeatedly ah uh, memories <laughs> okay uh, okay so change aim is L1 aim is R1 map is triangle uh, circle is to run and cancel for whatever Square is... Well, square and X are the same thing. Of course, uh, the D-pad is moving around. Option is select or... Uh, or the um, other side of the uh, touchpad. Same thing with status. Okay. Screen setup. Keep it all zero. <laughs> uh, monitor adjustment. Well, I mean, it looks... Well... The color isn't below the red line is a bit visible for me, so... Uh, can't really do anything with it because I'm playing on an HD TV. So, being that it's pretty late right now, what time is it? 12.57 a.m. My parents are, well, technically asleep in their room, so I'm going to try to be as quiet as I possibly can without really whispering. New game. Resident Evil. Oh, <laughs> old school. The American Midwestern town, Raccoon City, has been completely decimated due to the T-Virus outbreak that was instigated by the international corporation Umbrella. Claire Redfield, who arrived in Raccoon City to search for her lost brother Chris and a rookie police officer, Leon S. Kennedy, managed to escape from the city. But their ordeal was only a prelude of things to come. Indeed. Three months later. Your identification number is WKD4496. <sighs> Welcome to your new home. Her name is Claire Redfield. We caught her trespassing in our Paris lab facility 10 days ago. She apparently infiltrated the complex looking for her lost brother, Chris Redfield, one of the surviving members of RPD's famous STARS teams. Uh. Better run.
Apparently the only thing not visible is his face. If I were equipped with the lighter, I could see outside. And... The, uh... Item menu. Plague manual. Check. Check all items. When you obtain a new item, always remember to look at it with the check command on the status screen. Remember, it's always best to rotate the item so you can check it from different angles. Try to push objects. If you face an object, then press and hold up on the direction button. Sometimes you will be able to push it. You may find hidden rooms and items this way. Use the quick turn. You can turn 180 degrees instantly by pressing the cancel button while holding the directional button down. This is a very effective move when you attack an enemy and then want to turn around and run. Use the map screen. When you are lost or are unsure of what to do, check the map screen. You can easily tell where you've never been and can see which doors you have unlocked. Climb, descend. You can climb slash descend some objects. To do this, feel, feel, I can't believe I read this, feel, face, face the object and then push the action button. Security boxes. The items you store in the security box in the prison area cannot be accessed through an item box. Make sure you remove all important items from a security box before exiting a room. And there we go with that. Okay. Nothing else with that. So, uh... It's dark. Too dark. Lighter. <clears throat> An oil lighter. You can use it to light a dark area. Of course. Forces team. But in any case, this prison's been taken over. Troops have been wiped out. What are you saying? You're free to leave the complex. But you may as well know you have no chance of getting off this island. And what about you? What are you going to do? Don't worry about me. Sure, whatever. A hemostatic capsule is on the floor. It's empty. Haha, <laughs> take the handgun, boys. Yes. I'm so used to playing the remakes that I keep hitting triangle for the, uh, status screen. 9mm, uh, 19 rounds. Uh, these can be used with the M93R and Glock 17. Who? Herby herbs. Take the green herb? Yes. The only one here? Ah. This was made by breeding the herb from Raccoon City. Of course, Raccoon City is not the only place that has uh, herby herbs. Hey, you. You. His eyes are closed. He is bleeding. I'll need hemostatic medicine. 
It's a list of prisoners. My name's at the end. WKD 4496, Claire Redfield. The escort's name is at the end of the document. Umbrella, umbrella, blah, 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 umbrella, medical, Paris, third security unit leader, Rodrigo Juan Raval. There's, uh, yeah, it's him. Oh, yeah, comment night. Definitely need that. Surprisingly, one of the only, uh, few of the classic games that actually has the useful knife. Alright, nothing else is in Wait, wasn't there something else down here? No. Bye, Juan! Oh, yeah, yeah, I gotta get used to playing this. It's been a long time. Of course. That. I don't know if I want to pick that up right now or if I want to just wait. Due to at least, you know, the space. I think I'll, uh, hold off on getting it. For now. Uh, here we go. Graveyard. Of course, uh, way after the early 2000s when I finally got to play this game again through the HD version, I was able to beat it. And of course, when I bought this version of the game, again, was able to beat it. A truck used for transport. Oil is leaking out. Why did I read out? Oil is leaking from the crashed wreck. A dead body and a briefcase can be seen inside. Oh no. Lucky there. No. Whoa. Wait, wait, don't you? Who are you? Zombie? Well, great. We're right there. I'm coming over. Uh, sorry about that little misunderstanding, but I thought you were another one of those monsters. Shut up. Make one wrong move and I'll shoot. Relax, beautiful. I said I was sorry. My name's Steve. 
I was a prisoner on this island. And I'm guessing you're not from Umbrella either. No, I'm Claire. Claire Redfield. Claire? Hmm. Nice. I'll remember that. Hey, I hear there's an airport around here. And once I find it, I can finally escape from this crazy island. Well, I'll see ya. Hey, wait up! I don't want you following me, lady. You'll only slow me down. Wait, wait, don't shoot! <laughs> You've taken the handgun. And now... He actually fight against the zombies so that have rely on the knife most of the time. This is the central gate of the prison. It's locked. A hawk's picture is carved into the hollow. A truck used to transport. Meh. It looks like it crashed into the wall. Okay, let's see what this guy has. More handgun bullets! He is not breathing. And will soon be a zombie. It's been completely nailed down. It's impossible to open it. Of course. Apparently a dust box. Alright, let's go follow Steve! Steve! Abandoned materials are piled up here. Nothing useful. It's been locked with a padlock. Of course I need a key for that. Let's get that herby herb. Yes. Oh my gosh. Stupid. I'm so fine, apparently. Let's, uh... Okay, I guess he's dead. Another herby herb. How many minutes has it been? 22 minutes, 42 seconds. Guess I'll stop this part here and uh, start the next one. <laughs>